AP Chem students, it's not uncommon that problems on the free response section of the exam build upon each other. For instance, for a particular problem, you may need the answer to part B to answer part C. Well, the first question is always, well, what if I get part B wrong? If you can use that incorrect answer correctly in part C, you'll still earn the points for part C. Let's say you're taking the exam, you get to part B of a particular problem and panic because you draw a complete blank. Continue to read the problem. Part C, you realize you know how to do, but you need that answer from part B. So in your answer booklet next to part B, write down a number, then use that number to correctly answer part C. If it's a calculation, be sure to show your work. If it's an explanation, be sure to explain or justify in terms of the number you've written. This should still earn you your points.